Nyandarwa has now been included on the list of counties with confirmed coronavirus cases. One patient of the five new cases. Initially, out of the 504 samples tested, five new positive cases are Kenyans with only one having a history of travel. We have continued to test and managed to test some 504 samples. Out of this number, some five have tested positive for the coronavirus disease. Health Cabinet Secretary Mutahi Kagwe says mass testing is being conducted with priority being given to medical personnel. He further gave a reassurance on the distribution of personal protective equipment to medics. Yes, we have got the PPEs that we have said. We have got the 10,000 uh, PPEs. We have not distributed them across the country, but we have them. The CS also reiterated that Kenyans should avoid using physical money as it poses a threat of further spread of the virus. Despite mobile money operators facilitating the ease of doing e-transactions, we have noted with concern that people continue to disregard this advice. Once again, I am asking you to take all the measures that you can to avoid exchanging notes and coins. On disposal of face masks, the health ministry has pointed out that it is working with other government agencies and has circulated a protocol on COVID-19 waste disposal. We want to appeal to the members of the public, and this will only happen through continuous education and behavioral change, that the N95 masks should be left to the healthcare workers. The rest of the population can be able to use the ordinary face masks. For accurate reporting, the ministry says it will expand the content to cover serious pneumonia cases. We have decided as a result of that loophole to be able to expand the scope of the case definition to include severe pneumonia as a criteria for testing for COVID-19. The expected hiring of 5,000 health workers will however be done by the county service boards and not the public service board as had earlier been advertised. Caleb Bratemo, Weekend with Betty.